What is going on, everybody? New boot? It is me. Yes, sir. Yes, ma'am. Yes, I'm... <laughs> it's me. Guys, um, we are trying something new. And I am liking it. <laughs> Uh, yeah, have you ever seen a, a bunch of bales stacked like that? Uh, auto loader. I did not stack those. So I'm not going to even try to tell y'all I did. <laughs> but anyways, guys, check it out. Welcome. Welcome to New Boot Farming, baby. So, um, this, guys, is another series. This is going to be a New Boot Mega Farming series. And can anybody guess where we're at? Does anybody know? I'll give you five seconds. All right, it's over. Well, we're on the county line map. Um, it is a newly released map. Uh, it is a map from previous FS17. Um, I believe F FS15. Um, but I've never played those on uh, 17 or 15. But here we are on 19. And this is the official version of the map that was released. I believe I, I was playing on a version of the map that was unofficial that I don't know somehow anyways I put about 56 50 something hours into that map and trust me it was a struggle because I tried to record videos on it and anytime I was trying to come up here this is the cow farm by the way I'll show you I'm sorry going off on a tangent anytime I would try to come up in here and record my frames would just drop the frames per second would just drop and the reason being oh hey check it out guys <laughs> check it out let's see hey look at me look at me man i'm a good looking guy anyways uh yeah anytime i would go over here to the barn um the cow barn cow shed man it was just like it was it the frames would drop so bad it was due to because uh, there was so much stuff that was just so much detail and so many moving parts I believe my computer just couldn't handle it so but anyways um I, this isn't gonna be a long video i just want to show y'all what we got going on so this is the county line map this is the cow farm area so let me pull it up real quick on the map here so this is my area right here this is all I'll, that's all we own right here it's this little bit right here um but you originally start out this is where you start out right here i haven't moved my house yet i need to move the house so but anywho we are making we we are doing it up here you start off with like uh one point something million dollars and then you can sell the property or whatever you're on and uh, you don't start off with any equipment but uh i went out and i put pulled out a loan and i did a little bit of you know i guess you could say some loaning some money of my you know of my own uh by no means can you take out a three or four million dollar loan like you can on the last on the other version of the map you can take out a three million dollar loan i yeah i i couldn't believe it so but anywho i have some mega equipment here this is what this whole this is what this series is going to be about new boot mega farming uh, i had it going on the midwest horizon map and then there was everything that happened you know updates and all that stuff and me deleting my save games like a crazy person I ended up losing it and guys I don't know I'm getting a kick out of this whole third person view I love this this is awesome um, speaking of did anybody um, pull up their mod hub today uh, and by the way I'm playing on PC so did anybody pull up their mod hub today and just see like unlimited numbers of mods that came in and I don't know I normally was try to keep up with uh, the FS news uh, farm some news from DJ and I think I might have missed it today because I am completely lost when uh, seeing all these doggone mods in the mod hub. And uh, I, I was, I was, I was blown away. But that's super cool. Anywho, uh, I have a bunch of awesome tractors here on the farm, and that's what it's going to be about—just running tractors that I like. Um, you know, I love the old, old iron tractors. I love the throaty sounding John Deere, like this guy right here, man. This. This sucker sounds amazing. And, uh, just, oh, it sounds so good. It sounds really, really good. And like I said, this is, I'm on PC, so most of these are PC mods. So, um, I apologize for my console, f uh, friends. Um, 
it's why I kind of went from playing on Xbox to this because I just like the options, but that's just my opinion, you know. Uh, so I've got some uh, international harvesters over here. Uh, man, this map is really cool. Look at that, trying to be official. Got a pallet of seeds. <laughs> no, and I'm not even, I don't even need those. I have <laughs> seed tanks over there. Um, but yeah, I'm going to do some, I want to do some cattle here. And that cow, cow pen over there, you can hold 200 head of cattle. Uh, and here we have a John Deere, old John Deere. What is that? The 4440. And it's just awesome. This is how running real life right here, guys. <laughs> I'm <laughs> just kidding. We have the chrome mower. We have the uh, John Deere baler over here. I've been watching people play with this man, and I've been wanting to use it so bad. That's the kind of baler you look. You see, you know where I'm from. You see balers like that. Um, got the small square baler as well. And so this area right here, <laughs> I still can't get over this. This area right here is a huge grass field, and the field over there is a huge grass field. That's what we own. Uh, I don't have any fields yet. I do plan on buying a field. I've, I plan on doing some silage, obviously, uh, for the uh, cows. Let me see. I wonder what it looks like when I speed it up. Let's speed it up real quick. <laughs> this is hilarious. <laughs> oh, man. This is crazy. This is great right here. Oh, my gosh. But, golly, I'm over here. I'm just... <laughs> um so i'm bringing in I, I went and bought some stuff to start off with uh some silage bells some hay bells and some straw bells uh, i need to get some cows in here and like i was saying on the other version of the map this whole like this area right here was in such detail there was so many moving parts um there was fans in the top of the building there was gates when you open the gate there was another gate that opened and um like the oh, well watch out guy the loading dock would slide out it was just very very in-depth in detail so i don't know if it was just so many moving parts and my computer couldn't be, keep up with it which is um it wasn't cool you know there's there's some errors still here on this map uh, but i haven't noticed any errors like i had when i was playing on that other version which is the unofficial version and i didn't know until i watched uh some youtube videos come to find out is the unofficial ver version so and I guess I decided, you know what, let's let's go to the official version and uh, respect the, uh, you know, the map author. So uh, they did a really cool, really cool job. And also uh, Virtual Farmer did a tour on this map as well, I believe, yesterday. And I was watching his video on it. Uh, so this is pretty cool. It's like a milking parlor, I guess. I think that's what this is. I, I'm having a hard time trying to find the uh, trigger points, so I had to watch uh, VF's video. I had to watch Farmer Klein's video on this, trying to figure out where all the trigger points were at. But still, once you get them down, you know, it's cool. It's really cool. So let me get up in the air a little bit so you guys can see. Well, I didn't realize my, so my dude's going to stay down there when I get <laughs> um, So this is right here. This is just this is where we're going to be starting out at. This is going to be our start off farm right here and we're gonna do cows and then we're gonna move on to getting fields buying fields and crop harvesting but i'm gonna contract out a lot of work i want to do contract work and uh you know because the contracts on this map are they pay outrageous really good money so i'm um, not a specific brand farm you know i do have a, lot, a whole lot of john deere here but it's not going to be a specific brand farm it's just going to be old school tractors some nice big tractors you know mega farming that's what i want to do so um god i still can't get over this. this is hilarious uh let's see i didn't show you all the equipment um all right well there's that i showed you all that oh there we go look in there see that big case in there that's another sweet sounding tractor uh so we got the 9870 STS um, harvester, and then we have the uh, S790 harvester rocking the dual uh, row crop tops, and then with big floater over there, the big agri floater. Um, we have the John Deere uh, 95 9560 R. It's gonna be a big tillage tractor, big plowing tractor, or should I say, big discon tractor? You know, 
And then we have this big uh, section chisel plow, I would say. And it's going to be being pulled by the 8970. Old school right here, you know. Beautiful looking tractor. And I, not not every tractor is going to have a specific, uh, a little bit of specific piece of equipment. But, uh, you know, that's what I'm going to have. Mainly this case right here. Big Daddy, Mac Daddy case is going to be pulling this case set up right here. It's cedar, the big air drill. So that's what we're going to have it doing. And uh, I'll probably get myself another setup, another cedar setup uh, so I can get out there. These fields are huge. They're very, they're massive fields. So, uh, and then we have the John Deere 40 what is that the r40 uh, r4045 that's going to be our sprayer slash uh fertilizer spreader i have two tanks right here of the herbicide and the liquid uh fertilizer i do need to go get the i need to go the need to go get the sprayer body so that's going to be the next thing um this right here is the cell point for the cows which is really cool the shoots you know the, the cattle shoots man this is that's legit looking stuff right there that is, you know, you go to a stockyard, and that, that's what you see is legit uh, cattle shoots, and uh, that's pretty cool. So, um, but if, it, like I said, if anybody's ever been on that other version of the map or seen it, it's laid out kind of like this, but it's like totally different. Uh, does if that makes any sense? And then there's a new piece of equipment. I uh, a hay buster, man. This looks like it's gonna be awesome. Uh, it's a, a big. Um, Golly, what a, a tub grinder, big tub grinder. That's what that is. So that's going to be awesome to use. And this right here, guys, is for a telehandler. I don't know why, but this is one of my favorite ones to use. I don't, I like the articulating um, aspect of it. And then I like how you can see if I can. Yeah, there you go. I, I did a video on this thing, and it's got a, you know, a, a telescope telescoping boom and then look at this that's sweet now will, will i ever use that this is going to be mainly for cleaning out the the you know the cow shed here but <laughs> i don't know and then i put the little loader on the back i think that can come in handy i don't know maybe for weight or whatever i put that big old bucket on there it probably isn't going to handle it uh this set up right here this is like a feeding silo I still haven't grasped it you know I need to figure it out <laughs> I need to figure it out I don't know so I'll be working with that trying to figure out how to utilize that um, look at the milk tank I mean doesn't that look healthy that looks delicious chocolate milk baby <laughs> um, I put some small silos over here I think we can hold around about 700,000 these silos over here are just for looks they're just static now on the other version of the map, it those go and play with uh, right here. There would be a root crop storage, and I think those had stuff to deal with that. So, but anywho, guys, this is my little short clip vid of uh, the new boot mega farming. This is us with the upcoming um, getting started on starting our new adventure. You know, I'm gonna continue doing. Uh, grizzly mountain i love doing grizzly mountain i love the whole aspect of having to create fields and um live off the land there for sure you know but here is going to be straight knocking out contracts i want to bust out a bunch of contracts speaking of contracts let me show y'all real quick if i can uh let's see contracts over here look at these look at these contracts like oh um, well obviously potatoes that that'd be something dj goham would, would love to do is that potato contract but Look at the price, 103000 for a harvest, 145000 for a harvest payout, fertilizing contract, 102. So yeah, we're just going to do a bunch of contract work. And then obviously we're going to raise our cows. <laughs> contract work and raise our cows. That's what we're going to do. So, um, and using new equipment. So if you guys have any awesome equipment or anything that y'all would, you know, recommend for me to use, um, you know, like I said, it's going to be fun. That's what I want to have. I want to have fun, you know, using big machines. So if y'all have any, uh, you know, input on what equipment I should use, uh, let me know. Guys, if y'all like the video, hit that like button. If you want to see more, if you want to see what we have to come, y'all hit that subscribe button, guys. I appreciate y'all so much. 
Uh, I'm having a blast enjoying farm sim. This is uh, you know, this is my pastime uh, <laughs> when I'm not dealing with kids or working. So, all right, guys, y'all have a good one. I appreciate y'all watching. I'll see y'all on the flip side. Yee, yee, baby.